Temple Written by Objective Tell 6047 Oh no, I groaned to myself as I looked in the mirror. This couldn't be happening. Not today. I was finally working up the courage to talk to my first college crush today. I had rehearsed the moment in my mind so much I hardly slept. I felt relaxed, confident, and ready until I saw it. That damn pimple that appeared out of nowhere but suddenly mugged me as it formed on my forehead. It was small and red, but very noticeable. The white pus filled center pulsated as bacteria and dead cells form on the inside. The only thing I had to cover up was a band-aid. I can maybe fake a scratch on my forehead, but this made me abandon my attempt to talk to who may be the girl of my dreams. I went to class, and I felt like everyone was looking at me, and what I was hiding. They probably saw through my bandage. My crush sat down the table for me. I wanted to introduce myself, but my anxiety helped me hostage in my seat. It was the longest class period I ever had. In addition to feeling eyes and thoughts on me, the area around my seat was starting to itch. It was a mile at first, but steadily grew to where I couldn't even ignore it anymore. After class, I just wanted to go home and wash the pimple away. She stopped me by walking up to me. At first, she was asking about our assignment. Then she asked me about myself. I answered, not looking at her but feeling ecstatic on the inside. But I still felt that edge sweating on my covered pimple. She looked at it and asked if I was hurt. I told her I'm fine. I walked inside the restroom. I faced the mirror and pulled the band-aid off. It got worse in the last 90 minutes it was covered. The white center had grown larger and it was pulsing. Seeing no one else in there, I took the opportunity to squeeze the little pus bubble. With a little pressure of my two index fingers, the sit popped. A shot of pus and blood shot out of my forehead and on the mirror. I turned on the faucet and found drops of blood in the ceramic sink. And little squirming maggots inside. I looked back at my reflection and some maggots crawling out of what was a pimple. Out of the bloody hole, more and more came out. I kept wiping them away of my head, but they still crawl out of my forehead. I could feel them under my skin just itching to get out. I ran out of the restroom and bumped into my crush. She took one look at my forehead and the larva crawling out of my skull. 
The look on her face and the scream of horror she shrieked said it all. They are still crawling inside my head. <clears throat> oh god. <laughs> what a story by Objective Tales 6047. It literally gave me goosebumps as I the first time I read it and as I read it again. Hope that you folks enjoy it. You know what to do. Leave a like and a comment if you did. And like always, I see y'all on the wasteland.